Hi, I'm Kevin Cowan, and today on How To, we're gonna talk about how to erect a tarp. Tarps are very important. Uh, the reason why tarps are really important, and here, here's the thing, you have a tent, and it's a doghouse, okay? It's raining out, uh, everybody's gonna run to the tent, get inside the tent, that's a bad move, because it's very confining, uh, someone's socks are gonna smell, you, you're just not gonna get along inside the tent. So the tarp is good for two main reasons. Yeah, it's great for shelter from the rain and the bad weather, especially cold winds. That's fantastic, but also it's group dynamics. You're under the tarp outside, not in a confining space. You can put a, a fire underneath the tarp and get a good cup of tea going or a bush martini. And every, everything feels much, so much better. I mean, you are supposed to be out there. So, you know, don't get yourself stuck inside of a tent during a rainstorm. S spend money on a tarp, okay? Don't be cheap on a tarp. Uh, tarp is one of the best pieces of gear in your, in your pack. When you're looking for it, make sure it's light, really light, uh, light nylon. Uh, make sure that actually it's, um, it, it's even got fire retardant sprayed on it. That's really good because if you want to get a fire going underneath, that's really important. Look for a lot of loops, a lot of loops, not just the four corners. Make sure it's got maybe six, maybe even eight loops all the way around. Also a center loop is really important. Putting up a tarp, big debate in camp. Uh, everybody thinks they have the right way. Uh, there is no right way as long as you actually keep the water teeming off the sides and not collecting and sagging the tarp. So you got to keep the center uh, point up. How are you going to do that? Well, one way is to put a center rope between two trees and use that as your center. Best knot for tarp setup is the trucker's hitch. Need the loop, you need to put that around the tree, put this through the loop, and you use the loop to tighten it. And then you just put a slip knot like that around. And when the wind starts howling and everything else and this rope becomes loose, all you have to do is take the slip knot off really quickly like that and then tighten it again. Those two knots, perfect tarp setup. So you got this rope and you put the tarp over the rope. Choose four corners. This is where you have to be uh, creative. You're not gonna get four perfect trees in a forest in four corners. So find things like roots. There's a root that's above the ground. Perfect. Tie down for a tarp. So using a, a center rope to hold the tarp up is not bad. Again, the water is rushing off the sides, not congregating and sagging the tarp. It's a perfect setup. Another option for you is instead of doing the center line, you just put the tarp up with four corners up. But to do that, you got to do two, two, two high points and two low points. So of course the problem with this is that eventually that bot, that middle part is going to sag. Uh, it's just the way it is. So uh, what you need to do is you either get a long pole, uh, like a part of a tree, or even bring an aluminum pole if you want. Or what I do when I go canoeing is I uh, strap two paddles together and I use that to keep the center up. Uh, actually this is my preferred way is to use the center uh, loop and use a rope to yank over a limb and pull the top up. That's actually a better option. It's a lot more work though. So first thing you have to do is let one end go because you actually have to get to your center loop, obviously. So you have to get the rope over a limb somewhere way up. And you can tie a rock to 
a, a rope and hopefully it stays on, but most likely it won't and your buddy will be behind you and he'll get a rock in the head. You know, since I'm on a canoe trip, I can use a throw bag from, a ro from, a, from the boat and I got it all in there nice, perfect. I get the other end of the rope and I tie it in the center loop. So the idea, again, is get this rope over that limb in one shot. He does it. He does it. He does it. Woohoo! I do that every time, honest. So look at this. This is miraculous. I pull on this, the top rises up. Like that. Then I tie this down. There you go. Perfect. Let it rain. No problem.